Hello gamers, geeks and gays. My name is Sturx and welcome back to the Outer Wilds. Thank you to everyone. Just everyone. In the past two weeks, we have jumped up a whopping 100 extra subscribers. Um, we're on like 149 now at the time of my recording. And I can't thank you all enough. The love and the support has just surpassed all expectations. And I feel incredibly wholesome and grateful for every single like, every single comment, every single subscribe. You guys are awesome. That being said, I'm not going to talk about it too much, because otherwise I will just keep rambling. Last time we were exploring the Brittle Hollow, and we're going to keep exploring Brittle Hollow today. What I'm thinking of doing is either going to like the landing pad looking thing, or exploring some of the stuff on the surface. Um, not sure which yet. We will see what I feel like when we get there, I believe. But, one thing I was not expecting was how much I would enjoy the character of Rebeck. I know he only showed up for like the last portion of the episode, um, in the last episode, but, oh my god, I love the character creation. I love the character design, I love the interactions, the conversations we can have with him. I can't wait to meet the other explorers. That's just reminding me, we do need to go see Gabbro again, now that we've learned a bit more, now that more has happened. We do need to go and see him, um, and kind of see if there's any new interactions there, anything new we can learn. Because um, I don't know what qualifies. I don't know what qualifies as new. We have a bunch of stuff um, now in here. So let's just, let's just see what all the rumours are. And we can kind of see some of the stuff that we can maybe learn from this. And where we can maybe go to next, perhaps. Um, so. There's the Southern, Southern Observatory. Why is this connected? The Nomad decided to build a larger, more sophisticated eye signal there on Brutal Hollow South Pole. That's what that is! Okay, Rebek says you can't get to the observatory from the surface. They tried, but there is probably a path to it beneath the crust somewhere. There is a door to the observatory on the surface, but it's broken. Why do I feel like I need to sneeze? It's probably because I've been outside this morning gardening and I haven't taken my antihistamines. <laughs> ha! Right. Hay fever aside. Let's have a look. So we, we still can't find the probe tracking module. What's going on here? And I know my mind's everything's po pointing towards the Ash Twin project. The Hanging City. We've been all through the Hanging City. We know stuff about that. What's the vessel? The vessel's warp core broke when the ship crashed in Dark Bramble. Okay. And the anglerfish fossil, that's something that I need to learn about. The, the Nomai learn to evade anglerfish, theoretically, at least, by studying an anglerfish fossil that they found on Ember Twins. We're going to have to go to the Twins at some point. The Black Hole Forge is suspended below the Hanging City. I find a switch in the Meltwater District that raises and lowers the forge. The Black Hole Forge District is the highest district in the city. We can't reach it, however. So I don't know how we can reach that at any point. Um, we're gonna have to, we're gonna have to have a look, and we're gonna have to try. In the meantime, let's go see what we can find on the hollow. Try kind of have a look at the surface again. I think. Um, I don't know how much more there is to explore on the underneath. But we can go and have a look. I love it when things line up perfectly. Look at that. Have you ever seen... We, we should probably go back to the interloper as well. Because we ended an episode landing on it once, didn't we? Um, and then that was pretty much it. We landed there. Watched the sun take us. And that was our experience kind of done. So it would be worth going back there. 
Now, let's have a look. So we've got this thing, which is very reminiscent of the probe cannon in orbit. Um, to the point where I'm thinking this is that gravity cannon thing that they mentioned. Oh boy, that's got like... Okay, so there is actually an, an area here. While we're here, let's have a look, shall we? Let's set down the ship and see what this area has to offer for Sturx to explore. Let's whack this bad boy on. Let's go and have a look. Right. Oh. Again. When everything's kind of lining up, I love it how everything's everything's got like the same orbit, which is weird. I don't know if that's just like ease of game design or if that's done on purpose. But it is quite cool that everything is like spinning in one big disc. I like that. It makes my uh, light OCD very happy. Speaking of very happy, imagine being able to sit down here and just kind of watch the universe go by as like one of the ancient Nomai. Like, imagine this place when it was like fully, like this is the stuff that survived. There's going to be stuff here that would have been here when the Nomai lived here. Like, I don't know. Is this like a little grove or something that they would live in that they'd come out and kind of watch everything? I don't know. I don't know. <gasps> okay, brittle hollow projection stone. Okie dokie. Is there anywhere else I can put it in before I put it in the projection? What is this going to show me? Okie dokie. Some big old tower. Now, this is definitely Brittle Hollow still. Okay. Interesting. Very interesting. I'm not sure. I'm not sure where that is. We will find it. Hopefully. For now. Down we go. Oh. 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 There is another place. Give me back your thing. Thank you. Let's have a look. What can I read on here? I'm at the shuttle. I'm ready to make my first pilgrimage to the quantum moon. That is exciting. You're almost ready. But there's still one more rule you need to learn. Come and see me at the Tower of Quantum Knowledge. Tower is on the opposite side of Brittle Hollow. If you follow the path west to the crossroads, you can reach the tower from there. My gratitude for the direction bells. I will see you soon. Is that where this is taking us then? The projection stone. It's another one of the staffs. I want I want one of these in my room so I can just have it like leaning there and I can just kind of admire it. I wouldn't use it for anything. I would just admire it. Is this bells, maybe? Or is this another one? Oh, this is just again the sound design and the soundtrack to this game are both absolutely mind-blowing. Right, that's going up, so there's got to be a way down. There we go. And another one. Oh, oh more places to go down. So this is like a little balcony where we can sit and sit and watch everything. Oh, no! Mmm. I'm getting much better at this whole movement thing. Right, so there's one way to go that way. The, oh my god. Right, so there's the crossroads over that way. The ship is still okay. The ship is still okay. We're fine. I will go up this way first. While we're at the... Uh, what I'm going to call the cannon. Oh my god, this place is massive. The Southern Observatory is that way, so we can go that way soon. Because that's where we actually started our adventure on Brittle Hollow. And um, which way is... Oh! 
I'm getting much better at this movement thing, aren't I? The crossroads. Okay, so I wonder where the crossroads is. Is that... I mean, judging by the direction, that seems to be taking us roughly back to... Back to there. And it's already... The, the bridge is already broken. The bridge is broken in two places. That can't be good. It did break in two places last time, did it? Hmm. The shuttle is currently resting at the quantum moon. Alright. Where's the quantum moon? Activate the gravity cannon. Call the shuttle home. What? Hang on, so if I... Is that gonna just... Right. Oh. Oh. No. Okay, I didn't just destroy a valuable no my relic. What is in here? I hope this isn't like too far ahead of where I should be. I'm just I'm just tinkering. Wow. That is I'm on and know my spaceship. I'm on and know my spaceship. I'm on and know my spaceship. Oh yeah. It's very pretty. Very, very pretty. I'm here. After watching it wander the skies for so long, I am about to stand for the first time on the quantum moon. As expected, my shuttle has landed at the moon's south pole. I will make the remainder of my journey on foot. We don't know why the quantum moon always welcomes its visitors at the South Pole. Just that this is true. As a child, I considered such unknown sinister. Now, though, I understand they bear no ill will. The universe is, and we are. I am ready. That's the same Solanum that was writing on the walls in the Hanging City, I think. Who is kind of having doubts as to what this signal is and you know is it good or is it bad oh. ah whoa Um, right, so that fires us. What's that do? Have I killed the ship? Okay, so I've just killed the ship. Okay. Right, 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 right. I don't know. Ooh. Oh my god. I want to know my spaceship. Do we have the power or do I need the gravity cannon? I mean, it looks like we've escaped orbit. Where is it? Oh my God. I don't know what I'm doing with this. I'm just, I am just playing. Oh my God. This is just beautiful. I am, however, going to have to go back because I I don't know what I'm doing with this. I do not feel qualified to operate this yet. I feel like there's definitely stuff that I'm missing. Huh? But how... Out of interest, is that like a... Oh! Is that like a way... I don't know. I don't know. And Brutal Hollow is doing its thing and falling apart. So, 
Right, so we found the cannon, and we can press about with our acetylated date, I guess. Um, was this the Southern Observatory? That's the crossroads. Which one was the observatory? Was the observatory further around? I think it was this one. Was it this one? Here we go. Let's follow the path. Oh, a cannon. Ah! Oh, no! 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 But you're still here. I thought you were the thing that fell into the black hole that we tried to get to, the tower, was it, in the last episode, where it just kind of... fell? I mean, okay. I mean, we're here now. There's not much else I can do. I don't think I can escape the black hole. I don't really know. What is this? Let myself a bit of a oh, look around. Ah! Ooh! Okay, I know how these works. I've seen these doors before in the probe cannon. We have trees? Where am I? What is this thing? I guess we'll go and... Ooh! Land. Right, so... Uh, let's see, we've got, we've got stuff all around the place. Got this thing and Brittle Hollow. Welcome to the White Hole Station. If you fell through the black hole by accident, don't worry, you aren't the first. This warp tower can return you to Brittle Hollow. <gasps> Every warp tower is tuned to a specific astral body. A tower's warp can only be used during the brief window when the tower is aligned with its corresponding astral body, in this case, Brittle Hollow. You must be standing on the warp platform on the floor during this alignment to be warped. If you look up while the station is rotating, you see the alignment happens when the astral body is directly overhead. Okay. Now, where is the projection stone? Is it downstairs? Oh. The Ember Twin projection stone. Can I take this back? I don't know. Ah! Oh! Hang on. Can I not? Oh, I can't see it! Alright, right, right, right. I will, I will figure this. I will figure this. Don't tell me. I will figure this out. He said to be standing on the platform when it's aligned. Right? That is what he said. So I need to see what's directly opposite it. I think... Is it the white hole? Oh, are we just going to keep spinning? Oh, I think we're just going to keep on spinning. Ah, okay, that's not exactly what I wanted to happen. I thought I could stop it. Okay, so it's going to keep spinning regardless. Now, how do I get out? I need to be standing on here? Or do I need to be standing on, like, the top? Do I need to be standing on the top? Right, let me let me let me read this again. If you look up below the uh, you can see the alignment happens when the astral body is directly overhead. 
tower's warp can only be used during the brief window when the tower is aligned. You must be standing on the warp platform on the floor. I'm guessing it's this warp platform. I don't know. I feel like I'm missing something. I feel like I'm missing something. Right, it's got to be lining up soon, right? Because I'm standing here. Hey, all right, okay. Ooh. Wow. That's what these are. That's what they are. Oh my God. Okay. Turn warp, status charge, step onto the warp receiver platform to activate the warp. Oh my god. So there's alignment with different <laughs> warp stations. Felspar's spare jetpack fuel. It's annoying to schlep across the planet to the ship if I can't use my jetpack, so I'm leaving this here. I checked with my little scout. I do too use it. Hornfells, you burnt marshmallow. And the scout's integrity reading said this piece of brittle hollow is as stable as any, but... Who knows? If the fuel's still around, feel free to use it. If not, well, wherever you're reading this note, I'm sure you've got bigger problems. Thanks, Feldspar. Right. The Hanging City is below us. Okay. That looks very much broken. So anything else up here of use? Oh, you can see them getting warped. To our friends on Brittle Hollow, I just walked here from the White Hole Station. On the other side of the Brittle Hollow's black hole, our design worked. We've successfully recreated warp travel. I don't know how close it is to an owner's original design, but as long as what we built works, then I am delighted. I knew we could do it, Cassava. I hope you're reading this. Wait, this can't be correct. Clary, have you seen these readings? they're accurate, they would violate causality. There must be an equipment error somewhere. I'm returning to the White Hole Station. If you and Root meet me there, we can run a full diagnostic and hopefully locate the problem. Don't tell Cassava. What? What problem? Oh no, I don't have time to get this to somewhere to read. Raimi and I have reviewed the records you sent, Poke, and they appear to show Nomai arriving at the warp received on Brittle Hollow slightly before departing from the Whitehall station. I understand this is in the odd, but Clary and I have tested and retested the equipment, and the result is the same every time someone warps. The interval is incredibly minuscule, roughly a hundred thousandth of a second. Do you suppose that instruments can't accurately measure time to such a small degree? As I've already told Raimi, these measurements can't be accurate. How can I know my arrival in Brittle Hollow before he or she ever stepped into the teleporter? The implications are absurd. Poke, as Pi is confident the reading is inaccurate, she's kindly helping me attempt to recreate this phenomenon in the high energy lab. Ember Twins Equator, come here at once, you need to see this. Okay, we have our next heading. We have our next heading, I have to follow this through. Oh my god, what is going on? My little mind is blown. And I'm aware I could have turned on the pause time when reading, but for me, I find the immersion a lot better when it's not stopping and starting time when I'm reading. So, using an Poke's warp core we're arriving at the place before we leave the other place. But how? Is this maybe like the start of how they find how to do the masks? And the statues, maybe? Because if they're sending stuff and it, it's kind of arriving beforehand... Is this like where they start to maybe figure out that they can send information backwards in time? Maybe. 
I don't really know, to be fair. <laughs> I'm not an expert. But that's where, like, that's where my brain's going with this. Because the Ember Twin, I'm guessing, is... Well, it's one of the twins, right? It's one of the Hourglass Twins. So there must be... The Ashen Twin Project must stem from this somehow. Because it's at, it's at the same... It's at the same place, it's at the same lab. Or very close, anyway. I'm not sure. Maybe they're the two twins, Ashen and Ember, maybe. I, just pre I presume the Ashen twins. I keep reading it as plural, maybe it's not plural. Am I been reading it wrong this whole time? I could have quite well been reading this wrong the whole time, which makes me very feel very silly. Now I'm split, though, because I want to finish exploring the Brittle Hollow. But I can feel my interest being pulled to this Ember Twin. All because I accidentally fell in the black hole. Because I am not very good at moving. <laughs> oh my god, this game! There's not many games where, like, a genuine accent can lead to you learning something that you otherwise wouldn't have learnt. That is absolutely amazing. Thank you guys so much for, for showing up. Thank you for watching. Thank you for the continued love and support. It means the world to me. Um, this is going to be a long series. I'm going to explore everything the game has to offer. Afterwards, we do have some other games lined up. And the Soma Revisit is in the works. It's just going to take a bit of time. Um, just alongside everything else that I'm doing. But we'll get there. In the meantime, everyone, hope you've had a good day. If you haven't already, let me know your thoughts in the comments. Um, obviously, without spoiling it for me. But yeah, I, I think that's where this story is going. I think we're going to be going to the Ember Twin. And that's where they kind of discover time travel shenanigans. Maybe. We will see. However, that's enough of me jibber-jabbering. As always, guys, I have been Sturks. You guys have just been incredible. I'll catch you all later for the next part in our adventure. <laughs>